Hi and welcome to the dead ball area. Whilst Nathan Hughes scored a lovely try against Sale in round 12 of the Aviva Premiership and we're going to look at it in a little more detail. Wasps play a very simple style of rugby that revolves around getting their powerful back row of Hughes, Johnson and Haskell over the game line and their backs flooding into the space that leaves. Hughes' try stems directly from that. Wasps play a five-man line-out and go off the top to Simpson. This is really important as it gives Wasps quick ball and the ability to beat Sal to the game line. Now if we stop there, we can look a little closer at how the two teams are set up. Wasps have dropped Hughes and Johnson into the midfield, indicating they will carry to the game line. In fact, throughout the game, Wasps repeatedly run this setup. Johnson and Hughes carry to the game line off first phase ball. And Sal know this and set up to counter it. Easter has dropped into the midfield to help out and Leota is slightly wider watching for the wraparound and looking to shut down Wade and Daly. Now normally, Good would lay off a short flat pass to Hughes or Johnson or play the ball out the back door deep to Wade. If he passes to Wade, he will then look to liquid Daly and attack the wider channel. Hughes and Johnson have held the sale midfield, so on this instance he ignores both the short and deep options and passes to Jacobs on the slide behind Hughes. And that allows Jacobs to drift out, interest Easter, and when he bites, pass to Miller who's attacking on a hard line on Easter's outside shoulder. Now usually you would expect Leota to read this and step in on Miller. He's a very astute defender, but earlier Miller and Daly ran a switch from their original setup and you can see from his hips and body shape he's actually jockeying out worried about Daly taking him on the outside arc. Additionally, Hughes having run his dummy line is now in a position to support Miller and once the tackle line is breached it's a case of correctly executing the two versus one. It's a really nice try scored from a simple well executed strike move and I think that this reflects the fact that Wasp have been playing some really good rugby of late. Here comes Miller, the gap open, the offload to Hughes, as simple as that.